everyone. Uh, today's video is my March favourites video. Um, I've not got quite a lot of things. I have some skincare things and stuff. Um, but up until recently I've not been spending a lot of money because I'm going on holiday and trying to save my money. It's not working very well but um, first off I'll start back with skincare. March favourites. Um, these cleansing wipes from Boots. I got them because they were on offer. And they're actually really good. I'm not, they're not something to rave about. They do their job, I guess. But I've got Elle McPherson's The Body Bare Ultimate Moisture Body Butter. Um, this is in my favourites because I stole it off my mum. And um, it actually, I've actually used it quite a bit. But um, it's actually really good. Um, I did start using it on my face by accident and then got a major breakout, so I don't do that. But, um, yeah, it's quite good. Considering I had a breakout um, from that, I got this, which is Olay's um, Complete Care Day UV Cream for normal to dry skin. Um, and I've been using this quite a bit, but I, I haven't actually started on that yet, I just use a lid, um, and I don't know, it's good, I went through a phase where I was having a bit of a breakout from it I think, but um, I'm okay now, my skin's gone clear again, I don't know, maybe it's just my skin, not the cream, um, but this is actually quite good because I've noticed the difference in my skin on my face a lot, it's not as dry as it used, as it was at the beginning of like two weeks or three weeks ago since when I first bought it. Um, Another thing that I've been favouring a lot this week is, this week, this month, is the Lash Accelerator by Rimmel, but in um, extreme black, not just black, because I like to test these things out and see if there's a lot of difference. There's not that much difference. You don't have to apply that um, as much to your eyelashes. But um, I actually really love this, and a lot of people rave about it on YouTube, and I just wanted to get in there and rave about it as well. Um, it's a really good mascara. Um, £8.99 I paid for this. I think it was worth it. And another thing that I've been using a lot is Rimmel's Exaggerate Eyeliner. Um, I think I've been going for a Zoe de Chanel look. Um, not that I'm any good at that look or anything, but... Um, Perfume wise, I've just been loving my Alien, which you can tell because I'm nearly out, which isn't good. For my lips, even though I keep my makeup to a minimum, it has to be Beehive by 17, um, which looks like this. Um, really like that, I don't know whether I should swatch it or not, it's coming up quite well on the camera. Um, and... Uh, I actually really love that. I haven't used it quite a lot. I've used it quite a lot for me, but I haven't used it a lot because I don't tend to not wear a lot on my lips. But it's really nice. And talking about lips, you can never go without a Vaseline. Um, I just went for the normal one. Usually I get the aloe vera, but this, this isn't a product, but I have actually gone on to um, eyelash curlers. I used to hate them when I, when I first started this channel because I had a phobia of them I think because I used to think they were you know they were gonna cut my uh, my eye lid but they don't I'm safe I'm not a maniac with them and uh, they're actually I I think you can definitely see the difference when you put mascara on you don't need as much mascara uh, and then nails first I actually finally found um, a barium nail effects in a boots in my, my town um, and re I just ended up freaking out in the middle of the shop with my friend she uses this against me a lot um, I had to buy two because I just thought that I was not gonna um, find it again so I got that this month and I've been using it a lot um, as you can tell on my nails I think it's I think it's quite I don't know, I like it, but um, I'm not that, I don't know, I think it looks better if you have um, 
a vibrant colour underneath it than a um, neutral colour. So. And talking of nails, my two models own purchases, I've been raving about them this month and they're definitely my go-to nail polish as of now. Um, and maybe Barry M, but these are my, my go-to colours that I'll be wearing a lot this month. Um, short and sweet, uh, February, February, March favourites. Um, and I'm back on a roll making videos, which I'm really excited about. So um, thank you guys for watching and subscribing and stuff. 